Now we'll convert the largest number into smallest number program. So for that, you have to stop the debug. So same program, you can convert this one to smallest number. So here change this code to smallest. Smallest initially you have to assume the bigger number all f f f f all eight digits. All eight digits you have to assume it as f f f f five data. Second, you can give any random data. So I give you a uh, random data of one zero zero eight 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 eight. Okay, one zero 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 eight 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 eight. Some random data you can give anywhere, and you can give still lesser value. Any data you give, whatever you want. Okay, the smallest you have to assume it as eight F. And replacing largest by smallest. And one more thing you have to change by comparing, you have to change smallest is less than no, that one you have to change it to greater. That's all. Now, compile this, start debug. Open this call stack window. Okay, I am placing here this window. And you can see array elements also. So start with array initialization, unsigned long, all are 32 bit. Eight extra digits are actually here. It is initialized with these data. Initially assumes smallest is FFFF. -F -F -F. Okay. For i is equal to zero, i less than five. Initial value of i is zero. Zero is less than five. Okay, it is going to execute this. Smallest is greater than array of i. Smallest is greater than smallest is what? FFFF is greater than array of i. Definitely FFF is greater than 3333. So replace smallest with this value. Okay. So it is checking smallest FFF is compared with this value. So this is replaced with this value. The okay, smallest is going to replace with this because array value is actually smaller than what we initially assumed uh, uh, smallest as FFF. After that, I plus plus will take place after this close bracket. I plus this will take place. Now i value is 1. i value is 1. Now 1 is less than 5. It is going to enter this for loop. It will check the smallest. The smallest is now 3333444 and it will compare with the array of 1 that is 1000. Again Smallest is actually 333, array of i is this. So it is true. So it is going to replace the smallest with still smaller number, which is 1008888. After that, i plus plus will take place. Next, uh, i value is what? i value, if you keep here, you will see i value is 2. You can also check here. 
2 is less than 5 so it is going to execute enter the for loop and current smallest smallest is 1000888 array of i is ff f b b b b it is not true now smallest is not greater than array of i it, this condition fails so it is not going to replace smallest with array of i element so it is going to skip this line again i plus plus will takes place uh, the smallest is compared with uh, the type plus plus value is 3 3 less than 5 it will compare smallest current smallest with array of 4 that is array of 3 that is 0, 0, 00999 now this condition is actually true because smallest is 1008888 it is greater than 0, 0, 0, 00999 so it is going to execute smallest is equal to array of i so it is going to replace smallest with a new value and i plus plus will take place now i value is i value is 4 it is less than 5 it will check smallest current smallest is 0, 0, 0, 0099 array of i is 111000 this condition fails it is going to skip this line and i plus plus will take place so now i is 5 i is 5 and it is not less than this condition fail so if the condition fails it will come out of for loop after that these are the extra code to display on ports so you have to open i borrow port 0 port 1 port 2 port 3 three times you have to click open here it is already click see if i click this it will go if it is not visible go to peripheral it will display here so here it should display uh, first byte is 9 second byte is 9 third is 0 fourth is 0 so it will first display 9 9 second it will execute p1 is also 9 9 third byte is 0 0 fourth byte is 0 0 so in the ports it is showing smallest number or it can stop verifying the output in the local variable first